Hello, it's Bob from Unsolved Boston, Massachusetts. It's December 7th, 2014. This is Sunday. It's the last day of the 27th week on the Walt's Diet. This video is in two parts. The first part, I do a short reading to assess my speaking. And the second part, I talk about the events of last week. So here's my reading. <clears throat> there is never a fee or eligibility requirement. One call is all it takes. Staff are available during normal business hours Monday to Friday. After hours appointments are available as needed. All service link staff conversations are confidential. Okay, that's the end of my reading. Now part two is the events of last week. Well, what a difference a week can make because last week was the best week I've had in the over six months I've been on this diet. Uh, last week, the first part, the first thing I should report is that the pain in my right arm really decreased a lot. It's so much so that um, it's easier for me to get out of bed. It was difficult because I couldn't use my right arm to roll out of bed, but now that's a lot better. Number two is, and this is really, I'm really happy about this part, which is that my legs appear to be getting stronger which has never happened in the six months that I've been doing this. What happened was um, I went up to get a bowl from the cupboard. What I have to do usually is get out of my wheelchair by using my upper body strength with the arms of the wheelchair and the counter to get up and get the bowl. But this time, I was able to do it uh, much easier than before because my legs were, were stronger. Number two, the second reason I say that is that I was able to get out of my wheelchair to stand up. What, you know, I needed help to do it. That is, I needed my arms on that lid to the wheelchair to get myself up. But I was able to stand up once I was up and pull my pants up, which before the nurse would help me do that. I was able to do it on my own. So I, the way I see this, it's beginning to begin uh, to have an effect. And my mood about this diet has changed completely. This is a great week. Like I said, the best week so far. Uh, those, I guess those are the two major changes in the, that have happened to me physically. Uh, also mentally, my mood has changed greatly because of what happened last week. And uh, the other thing I wanted to cover is I did make three significant changes to my diet over the last two months. I might have said this. In October, I kicked beef heart stew out of my diet and replaced it with chicken liver. The reason I did that is because a lot of people on Facebook reported that Dr. Walls was very high on chicken liver as a way for meeting the organ meat requirement of the Walls protocol. So I'm doing I'm eating chicken liver twice a week. The second thing is I increase the number of smoothies. I and I'm using coconut oil in each one of them. So I was doing two smoothies a day. Uh, now I changed to three. And I use coconut oil in each smoothie. That, now that probably changed about three weeks ago. 
The fact that I used three instead of two smoothies was about two weeks ago. And then the third thing is that uh, I bought a water filter. I no longer drink tap water at all. Even when I make tea, I use the, the water from the filter. And it's a standalone unit that I bought at Amazon. It's made by Pure. It's P is in Paul. U R. That's the name of the filter. It has 18 cups and it goes in the refrigerator. Very easy to use. And uh, uh, so that's that. And um, so hopefully, uh, you know, this success will keep going. My my feet feel like they're waking up. I'm getting very nice sensations in my feet. Uh, this is I'm. I'm, this is really fantastic what's happened. I can't believe it because in the six months, I did leave the diet for three weeks. And I've had maybe eight rounds of antibiotics. So I've had a very hard time. Uh, and I was going to quit uh, for a while there. I was just really down on the diet. But last week, that all turned around. Um, so hopefully, this will keep going. I'll be back next week to talk about what happened on week 28. And that's it. Bye-bye.